News Channel 8's Lenny Sue Paul joining us live from St. Petersburg tonight with a story. So what's the consensus from the city? It's been a long night there. Oh yeah, we're going into our fifth hour right now and still no decision has been made. The meeting actually has been very slow moving. Commissioners going line by line, scrutinizing every detail about this proposal. But tonight, several residents fired up. They have a very distinct message for commissioners. Residents packing tonight's city commission meeting in St. Pete Beach, keeping a close watch on a plan that would expand the Serrata Beach Resort on Gulf Boulevard and clear the way for construction of two new waterfront hotels, a JW Marriott and Hampton Inn. The two hotels would both be several stories tall, bringing a combined total of more than 400 hotel rooms to St. Pete. We are quaint, nice city. And I'm going to use the word carpetbaggers are coming down from all over the country trying to make us into an urban area. That's not who we are. That's not who we should be. Jody Powell has called St. Pete Beach home for more than 60 years. She remembers a time when the coastline was quiet. An eyewitness to the fast changing landscape over the decades. She's worried about the future of the beachfront town. We don't have high rises on our beach. It's all been small mom and pop hotels that got along with everyone. Now they want to build big and it brings in more traffic. So we don't want to be another Clearwater Beach, Daytona or Atlantic City. We don't want that. So it's just a matter of time before we see how commissioners will decide on this proposal. Based on the discussion, they do appear to be pretty split on the matter, but we'll continue to stay out here and keep you updated along the way. Reporting live in St. Pete Beach, Lenny Supal, 8 on your side.